Welcome back, survivors. Disturb Z here, and we are back in Timberborn. See what we got going on today, guys. So, we've got a few things. Uh, I'm trying to think here what, what can we do? What can we not do? So, I've had a couple of suggestions. Uh, I haven't had a chance to read many comments today. I do apologize. I have been super, super busy. And I'm trying to rush to get things done. Uh, one of the comments had suggested about maybe removing, I think it was this wall. Or maybe it was even this wall. One of the two. Or all of them. Uh, removing the walls so that we'd have like access down here as well. Um... It would work. Uh, right now, I mean, it kind of serves a purpose, but it kind of don't serve a purpose. I mean, we could reclaim a little bit of land here, but at the same time, we do have like our little perimeter walkway. So I'm not exactly sure how many of the beavers are using that. So that's, you know, that's a thing. Uh, let me see here. Okay, so it is... Okay, so we're still in the drought, so we do have... Have this, and like I said, I haven't had a chance to read the comments, so I'm not 100% sure if y'all want me to change this up or or leave it, or you know what we're gonna do with it just yet. So I'm gonna kind of I'm gonna kind of leave that area alone for right now. I want to see. Let's speed it up. How low are we over here? We are what? Um, we're not quite at halfway yet. We do got. The berry bush is down, though, so that's good. But we're not all the way down to have that drained. Okay, so we've got that. Let's see. Our potatoes are coming in. Do we not have you... Let me have you set on potatoes. And have you set to replant. Yeah, because we've got a whole lot of potatoes not being replanted. So we'll just do that. I guess, I don't know if I want to leave this one on carrots or not. I kind of do, I kind of don't. Uh, let's see, we'll leave it like that for the moment. How are we doing on food? We are really good on food. Wow, we've got so much bread. Uh, <laughs> that little bit of, that little bit of flour that we ground up, we done, yeah, we done turned that into a ton of bread. Okay, so I think let me see here. We've got 113 scrap. Okay. So I can build the yeah, I can build the smelter now. So we'll have the smelter. That's gonna take us two hundred horsepower to get that smelter built. Um Kind of thinking, how does this fit? Does it fit directly? Okay, so I can do that. All right. Okay, so we're gonna need we're gonna need logs, treated lumber, and gears in order to build this. So the first thing I need to do is probably get the smelter going. We're going to have to get a lot of power over here, I think. That's going to be that's going to be the big thing. So, let me put that down. Let me see about the wood workshop. That's the one we're going to need in order to get the treated uh, planks. Okay, so we've got how do where do we want to put that guy? Do we want to put him down here like so? Do we want to bunk them up next to each other? Uh, let's see. If we bunk them up, so that's going to be 250. That's going to be 200. Wow, that's 450, uh, 450 power that we need to accomplish here. So what I'm thinking is... How do we want to do this? I'm kind of thinking we need to move these pumps. Um, this pump, for sure, that one's going to go. We're just going to get rid of it. I already know there's water in there. I don't care. We're going to get rid of it. 
not that big of a deal. We have big water tanks over here. Uh, so they're not going to starve. They're not going to, you know, nothing like that from removing those. But I am going to get rid of this one too. And this guy as well. Okay, now I can either do the big water wheels over here or I can do the uh, do the generator and see what that's all about. So if I do the big wheels, let me see. So if I did that one, the problem with it would be right here. So now if I do that, does that connect both wheels or does that only connect one wheel? That's, that's what I'm curious about. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to unpause this. And we're going to let them build. If it works, great. If it doesn't work, I'm just going to flip the... Uh, I'm not going to flip it, but I'm going to move the, uh, the power connection. I'm going to go around it. I'm going to loop them together, make like a big U, maybe a C-shape type thing you know, to grab both ends of that, bring them around, and then we'll bring it down. But even then, those power wheels do what? 180 a piece? So, that's only like, what, 360, I think? Yeah, 180 and 180. If we get max power, that's only 360 at most. And we're needing like 450 down here. So, I'll probably need another set. Which will be fine, but we're going to let that build first. We're going to let them do their thing, get stuff going, and we'll just see how, how everything goes. Now, down here, we got so much farmland and so much other stuff going on. Um, what I would really like to do, though, is I would like to... I'd like to put some temples and stuff down. That's what I'd like to do. I, that idea of surrounding this area in like a bunch of temples and campfires... I love that idea, that idea. I love the fact because you can only put... I think you can only put the temple on the ground, right? I think that's how that works. Yeah, ground only. So, that's a, that's a pretty big guy right there. But if we did it right, I could put one over here for him. I could put one over here for them. I can put another one over here for these guys. And then we would have, you know, temples in different areas for different uh, different districts. And I could get them all down here. <laughs> It'd be weird. We'll have, like, some weird religious mind thing going on, you know. All hell the, the quartz rock or whatever it is we find in there. All right, how are we doing over here? Is this drained at all? Not really. Not really. Okay. It is... Eh, they're almost ready to get that built. I am curious, though, if I build pumps over here, if we can generate enough power to turn a wheel. Um, oh, that reminds me. There was a, a comment. Uh, I don't remember who made the comment. But the comment was made about using water dumps to keep those power wheel those water wheels running and i was curious if you have water dumps dumping water would that be enough force to turn the uh the power and like you know the 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 water wheels would it be enough to generate power and if it was how much would it generate 
Because I'm kind of curious, because if we, if we could do something, I'm thinking like, you know, the, the mechanical water pump, if I had it powered by, you know, have it power itself type thing, that would be, that would be hilarious. Make a, uh, make a, a, a self-powered machine type thing. I think that'd be hilarious, but I don't know if it'd actually work. I don't know if you can move enough water to actually generate that kind of power. So we'll have to, I'll have to see about that sometime. I'll have to play with it, but I am curious though, if I can get a set of pumps over here and then have them, you know, pull water and see what it does. Oh, those are still too low, aren't they? Hold on. There we go. So we're going to do that. We're going to put in a couple of pumps over here just to, just to see what it does. Like I said, I kind of doubt that it's going to perform and actually do anything, but it would be hilarious if it actually did work and, you know, we could generate power and we had a flow and all that kind of stuff. So we shall see. We shall see. All right, yeah, of course y'all would get that built, like, quickly. Um, am I out of planks over here? Is that what's going on? Yeah, basically. Okay, well, that figures. All right, well, we're going to have to wait a little bit in order to, uh, to get that, get that going. Uh... trying to think if there's something else that we could be doing right now I don't know I've got so many different ideas for down here and I know y'all have been throwing out suggestions so and I've been trying to read them all but I don't know if I'll be able to do a lot of them some of them yeah for sure a lot of them eh we'll see we'll see what happens <laughs> All right, how low are we? Let's see, that is one step, two, three, four. Okay, so we're right about half then. Is that what we're looking at? Yeah, that's right about half. All right, well, half a block of water, and then we're going to have our uh, our next little farm over here. I think that'll be a good good little thing to have. Just enough, just enough to get wood built up. You know, well, we are starting to get some wood built up now, but... You know, it'll help out. It'll be nice. I like it. I hope I like it. Uh, let's see. What else do we have going on over here? I feel like there's something we're missing over here. And I need to get... I need to figure out what it is. Um, I know we're missing some leisure. Oh, that reminds me. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I had a excellent idea. It wasn't my idea. It was given to me. Uh, so one of y'all actually had a really good idea about up here and with the Lido. Yes. Let's see what we got here. Uh, does it not fit? I 
mean, it's three wide. Or is it one of those, do we have to, hold on, do we have to have it on, like, a flat dock? Is that what's going on here? Um... Not that one. There we go. And where is it? Leisure? No, so that's not this one. Yeah, so I could do it, but we're going to have to have, we're going to have to have another platform in order for him to get it. But I did like that idea of putting Alito up, up here. Uh, hmm. Yeah, it would need to have, it would need to have some sort of platform or something connecting it is what it would have to have. So, okay, hold on. Let's see. Can we can we play this out at all? Let's go ahead and do that. Okay. Okay, so if I did that, we're going to have to bulldoze this tree. Or this bush, I mean. That's the only, this is going to be the only way to do it. So I'm going to have to sacrifice one of the bushes, which should be okay. We should get some more planted here pretty soon, and that shouldn't be a deal anymore. Oops, that's one too tall. Oh, did I not select? I could have swore I switched that over to the second one. I guess I did it. All right, couple technical difficulties today. My hands just seem to want to do things their own way. They're like, no, we're going to go over here. We're going to do this, and you're not going to tell us otherwise. And I'm like, but things, stuff, places. All right, so let me see here. What can we do? You know what I could do is I could just run this straight down. Uh, okay, Um. hold on, hold on, hold on. Give me a sec here, guys. Okay, guys, sorry about that. Had some technical difficulties, had a couple distractions. It's one of those deals where like everything all all hit at once and I'm like, no, why? But anyway, I think I've got everything sorted out and situated now. So that shouldn't be an issue again. So anyway, we're gonna have a Salido right here. And I think that Lido is gonna fit in perfectly. It's gonna have nice um nice access. It'll have water all the time. The beavers will be able to hop in there and do what they like. Um, yeah, so I am digging it that we're going to get them Lido over here. Okay, so we do got both of these built. Uh, we got six point, well, six days left. And I'm trying to see, yeah, it's not going to show me. Did we get the pumps made? We have not got these pumps made yet. Okay, so I want to get these pumps made and see if pumping is going to draw the water and uh, cause those wheels over here to turn 
like at all. I th I think it might, but I don't think we're gonna get a whole lot of return out of it. I think it's gonna be one of those very very slight, very subtle type deals. And like I said, if we end up uh, having to do extra, we, then we do extra. What I'll probably end up doing is this. I think either way we go. Is we will do this. We will do that guy right there. That way if we need to come around in front and you know tie in, we can. That's not that big of a deal. Um, let me see. No, 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 game. Okay, so if we do that, then we need to come over here and we need to kind of drop it down a little bit. Okay, so they're still working on that. They have not got that completed yet. That's fine. No big rush there. I'm going to let them work on this in pieces as well because, yeah, that's, that's one of those deals. I'm not sure how much more we can actually do with... What we got, I might have to build, I might have to build a staircase going down, like right next to it, to be honest with you, in order for them to work on this thing. Um, and if we do do that, I'd rather build it on this side. That is not what I wanted. That is so not what I'm, why am I on... Platforms. That's what I was supposed to be on platforms. Okay, so we got that. Uh, let me see, let me see, let me see. What do we want to do? Okay, we'll bring it down to, I'm trying to figure out how I want to turn this and drop it down and keep that one going right next to it. So I'm curious, will they work off of the, uh, will they work off of the stairs? Is that like a thing? I think it's a thing. I hope it's a thing. Let's see what happens. So I'm going to let them finish building that out. Okay, well, we are looking good, guys. So we're starting to get down in here, starting to get things built. Uh, like I said, it's going to be it's going to be a little bit of a process here, especially getting that power down there. Once we get that power all the way down to those two buildings, I think we'll have a much better much better chance of getting some stuff done. All right, so let me see here. I'm going to go ahead and click on one of these. And we're going to see if anything moves because we do have that one pump built. So let's see. See if it creates any um, water, water tension, any movement here. Come on. Beavers, get over there and man the pump. Start pumping. Do your thing. Okay, the beaver is pumping. Yeah, I'm not seeing any movement. That one pump's been pumping for a minute now. I think there's just not enough, or did we set it up too high? Surely we didn't set it up too high, did we? 
No, that's in the water. Mm, yeah, I do think that's in the water. Okay. So no flow from a pump. Okay, well, I'm like I said, I'm all right with that. So we'll get we'll get that done. How are we doing over here? What's up with the Lido? Uh, let's see where are we at. This building needs deeper water to function. Ah, that's because the uh, the water has drained down below a block. So once it fills up, that Lido will be in operation, and it'll be a nice, good little thing right there. The little path, a little circle around. Hang on, my mouse moved. There we go. Let's get back over here and into things. Um, I don't know, guys. I'm open for suggestions. What do you like? What do you dislike? What do you think I should change? If I should change something, uh, y'all let me know. So, because right now I kind of have a couple of ideas, but I'm not 100% sure that I'm going to stick with those ideas. I might work towards it. I might pull off of it. I'm not exactly sure here. So, any any help, any suggestions is always welcome. Did we get... No, not yet. Okay. So, yeah, they haven't even started that one yet, have they? Come on, beavers. Build, yeah, build me, build me another platform. Come build me my staircase. Work your way down. Come do some stuff. We've got 2.8 days left in this drought to get something done. Whether or not it gets done or not, I don't know, but it does, it does do things, I guess. All right, guys, well, I think, I say we wait out the last 2.6 days and we see what happens when we get the water kicked back on. So I'm going to pause it here and I'll bring y'all back in just a moment. Okay, guys, so the drought is just about over. So let's see, let's see what we can do with what we got here. How low are we on this? Almost there, about an eighth of a block, okay. So we've got, are you set to, yeah, you're not set to do stuff, are you? Hold on, go to potato plant and yeah, do planting. Okay, so that is done. We should start seeing some water flow here in just a minute. Any second now. Let me go check this one over here. Okay, so these are flowing. Yep, they're flowing now. So that's 40. Okay, so they are connected. Yes, they are connected. Awesome. That's what I was kind of hoping for. Okay, so are y'all not going to... Ah, they're going to make me do this the hard way, aren't they? I was hoping that they were going to build this other piece over here, but I don't think that's going to work. All right. Well, let me, let me do the little spiral over here and see if we can't get the next stage down. Let's see what happens here. But, yeah, see, okay, so that's weird. So now we're getting water flow here, but no water flow there. Hmm. I wonder. So. 
so hold on. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. I don't know on that one, guys. I was wondering if maybe, maybe if we fill that in with blocks, we could get a similar power deal going over here to this one. Yeah, we're at 135 on this one still, so we're still really good over here. So that's not a problem. Um, but this one is doing something different. So I am curious as to what's going to go on here. So I'm thinking that maybe we should narrow this down. That's, that's what my first thought, my first impression of this is, is that this channel is too much uh, where the water sources are located, everything else. I think that we need to just come back in here. Okay, did we get it all? I think we got it all. All right, so just come back in here with, I uh, already had it selected with the uh, levees. And we'll bring it over here. We're going to see if we can't uh, lessen that channel, maybe force that water over some more and see what happens. Who knows? We might end up having to rip part of this out. We'll just have to build. We'll have to wait. We'll have to see what's going on. But I think that's probably about it for today's video, guys. So I'm kind of, I'm, I'm liking where we're at. We're not, you know, in the greatest of spots, but we do got both of those wheels turning right now. So we're going to get some more power going. We're going to run those power shafts down to those buildings. Once those buildings are hooked up, I think everything will just kind of come together. But anyway, that's going to be it for today's video. I do hope everyone has enjoyed it. If you have, be sure to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. It is an awesome way for you to show support to me to the channel, to the video, and to the game itself. And as always, feel free to share the video on any social media you're using. And guys, I'd like to stop, take a moment, and thank each and every one of y'all for all of your wonderful, awesome support. All the comments, all the likes, all the subscribers, and all the videos shared. It is awesome. I do appreciate it. And with that being said, until next time, survivors. Keep on surviving.